air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning into your reading, what they love most about you. Uh, and this is what your person really loves about you. Um, so we'll see what the cards can reveal using the Shadowscapes Tarot. Uh, your best qualities, your best features are why this person loves you or is in love with you or is falling in love with you. Um, so this may be helpful for you um, and we'll see if we can gather what they really think. Uh, this can be fall, Libra, Gemini and Aquarius. Um, and of course, if you did enjoy this reading, please don't forget to leave behind a like, a share um, and subscribe to the channel to get updates for readings for your sign. Uh, otherwise, um, let's jump into the reading. I wanted to um, use an affirmation card and just see what quote is applying to you and how your person sees you. Um, so what they love most about you, how they see you, what's sort of their energy. Okay, so a friend is someone who knows all about you and still loves you. Okay, so really strong energy that they feel very accepted by you. Okay, they feel like they, they love your friendliness. They love how close you are and they love that they can be themselves around you. That despite what has happened or what may happen, um, at the end of it, um, they, they've, they've come to really... Um, admire this ability about you to sort of take them as they are and sort of accept them as they are. Um, but this can apply to those that are in like a, a friend zone relationship um, or if you've built a, a friendship with this person first and then you've built a relationship on top of that. Um, they see you as a best friend um, and they see you as someone really close, okay, someone they can open up to about their fears, about their ambitions, about their insecurities. They, can, they feel like they can be completely themselves around you, air signs. Let's see what else comes up. What do they love most about you? Okay, they love how fun loving you are. Okay, four of wands is like a celebration card. So they love that life is like a celebration with you, that every day is almost like an adventure. Um, they love your happiness, okay, how playful you may be, you know, your sudden outbursts of singing or dancing or being festive. They like that you're the center of attention everywhere you go. Um, and they like that they can call you their own. So you're like a diamond here. You, you dazzle um, and you attract other people and people look to you. And they love that they can call you theirs. Um, and you are theirs. And this is what they really, really love. You know, they love your creativity. We've got the nine of pentacles, your creative talent, okay? Um, they could also love how focused you are when you start a new task, your energy, your drive towards these sorts of things. Um I feel like there's there's different components to you, different sides to you, which they really admire. Um, and I feel like that's coming up with the um, the moon. We've got the two of wands, the temperance. So the two of wands says to me that your open mindedness um, or your ability to either change. I don't know if this is changing moods, changing your mind. This is something that they admire about you. But it could also be like an exotic quality you may have. Okay, you may speak a different language. You may come from a different background. They find this very, very um, attractive. But what comes to mind, what stands out most importantly, we've got the moon and the temperance. So this is cancer with the moon. Now the moon rules love and compassion and tenderness. So air signs, this person loves how you look after them, okay, how sweet you can be, um, you know, that beautiful hug, that kiss on the forehead, the making sure they've packed their lunch to work, that care and compassionate side that you have, that caring and compassionate side that you have is something that this person is absolutely adoring, okay, they love it because they feel like they're looked after when you're together, they feel like um, you put them first and it's such an amazing feeling 
they feel very loved and the moon can also be like affection so if you're very touchy and you're kissy and you want to hop on top and you want to make love and um you know you're just affectionate and you may even embarrass them at times in public you know may yeah, especially if they're shy um they may get embarrassed with all the infection but deep down i feel like they really love it now the temperance can also be truthfulness adventurism and honesty so they admire your honesty or they admire your ability to be honest and to be upfront in certain situations. This is also balance, okay? So they somehow, um, what the, uh, they love most is your ability to balance each other out, maybe during arguments, uh, maybe you're astrologically, you know, you balance each other out, there's compatibility there. Um, but this can also tie into like the notion of having a strong friendship together. Um, but they love that bond that you have. Now, they love that they can say, like they can bring up an idea or, or mention something and then you'll sort of build on it with the Seven of Cups. They love that about you, that you're able to sort of build on that connection um, and, you know, make it happen. So in a way, they feel, um, they love that you inspire them, okay, because I feel like that's inspiration. You've inspired them to be a better person. Maybe you've even inspired, uh, inspired them to grow up a little bit. The Queen of Pentacles is growth. So you may have inspired them to be a better person, to be a wiser person, to be a more attentive lover, maybe to be a more understanding lover. So there's a lot of qualities that you've done. Um, but to crown that reading, that affirmation card uh, that indicates um that you have a friendship indicates that it's such a solid bond it's more than mere attraction yes you might be very attracted to each other we've got leo energy and that's very primal um you know it, it might be like leo energy in the bedroom and that's fantastic okay it's a bonus to be attracted to someone the way this person is attracted to you um because underneath it all you've got that solid friendship and attraction as i said it's just a bonus um you know, and they feel lucky, you know, they feel like sometimes they look at you and they're like, wow, I can't believe I have this person in my life. Look how she looks to the pentacle here. She's on the piano. Um, such a good energy. And this is all about the physical realm. Um, so I feel like, you know, this person really does have strong feelings for you. Um, and, you know, we've got the four of wands and this is a card of marriage. Um, so it could be that someone sees you as someone they would want to be married to, someone they want to make their wife or their husband. Um, you know, great maternal energy with the four of wands. So that's fantastic to see air signs. I will leave your reading at that though. So thank you again so much for tuning in. Please don't forget to leave behind a like, a share or a subscribe. Otherwise, I'm sure I'll catch you very, very soon. So take care, everyone. Please stay safe. And until next time, bye for now.